Shalom everyone, it's yours truly, Yeshua HaMashiach, the lion from the tribe of Yehuda. Greetings from America, from New York City. This is the day that the Lord has made. We shall rejoice and be glad in it. We just got a new president, Donald Trump. We voted him into office. And I have some concerns about my people and the Israelite and the black community the prophets, the false prophets, the messengers, to those who think they have it all figured out and all mapped out, to those who think that they know what God is doing. He is doing a new thing. This is the moment that we have all been waiting for and my people, you must wake up and get in alignment with prophecy. This is bigger than you and me. This is about the collective. This is about all of the tribes of the children of Israel. And as prophecy is being fulfilled today, and as we come into revolution, come into revelation of who we are and where we stand today in America, in this country, in this nation, as the children of Israel, as the Jews, the ancient Jews, the children of the ancient Israelites here in America today, we must work together with Israel. We must work together with our president-elect Donald Trump. I am the King of Kings and the Lord of Lords. I do not have to be on national television or on your interviews, for you already know what was written. And my spirit, the spirit of truth has gone out into the nations, into the world and into your president, whom I have chosen my God, the Elohim, has chosen and set up and raised up for such a time as this to bring down the system of Babylon and I will raise up the kingdom of heaven that is at hand. To he who has an ear, let him hear. There is a prophetess going on right now, a prophetess who is making waves right now and her voice is being heard. The master's voice, my sister Esther, you must listen to her and take heed to the master's voice. The next stop is Road. For she is the messenger to my people, to you, to the children of Israel in America and abroad. This is not up for debate. To all of the leaders, all of the politicians, all of my people in the Israelite community, the politicians, the lawyers, Candace Owens. Tamika D. Mallory, to all of the black Israelite sisters, my queens, rise. You will follow your kings. The kingdom of heaven is at hand. Dear sisters, and we need you now more than ever. We will lift up and raise a banner to the nations. We will pick up where Martin Luther King left off. For he did see the promised land and he saw the mountaintop and we will see the promised land. So help me God. You will see the promised land. So help me God. But we must rid the abominations of this earth. As we are raising up kings and priests and leaders in this new kingdom of heaven that is at hand as we prepare for space for the artificial age intelligence and the, the age of artificial intelligence as we prepare to fly, as we prepare for the robotic age, our servants, they will be our subservient, our servants. The kingdom of heaven is at hand. Behold, do you not see it? I am the Lion of Judah. I may not have appeared or returned like you may have thought I would have returned, but nevertheless, behold the Lamb of God, the Prince of Peace, light to the Gentiles. Yeshua HaMashiach, the Lion from the tribe of Judah, whom some of you know as Jesus Christ. I am here as a banner to the nations. I have returned for my people to judge the nations. 
This is the day that the Lord has made. I love you all. Shalom. Peace and blessings to you all. Godspeed. East Coast rise. West Coast rise. To all of the coastlands, rise. Africa, rise. Haiti, rise. Brazil, Russia, India, China, South Africa, rise. To all the un house and homeless prophets and messengers and to all of the angels and the Elohim under the sound of my voice I'm back we are back clear the closing doors please shalom